So today I will administer a piggyback medication. My primary bag is already hung and the tubing is connected. So the first thing you will do is check the mark for the patient's name, the date, the route, the medication, allergies, and the date of the dosaging. Um, after you've done that, you will then check for antibiotic compatibility. And three ways you can do that is to check a compatibility chart, call the pharmacist, or check a, rep a reputable site. Um, after that, I'll gather my equipment, which is together here on this table. Um, and I'll do my IV calculation. The medication I have was Ansem for... 125 milliliters over an hour and I've done the medication so my drop factor will be 21 drops per minute. So I now have my tubing open. Maintaining sterility I will attach the tubing to the bag. It is now attached. My clamp is closed. Okay, now that this is purged, I'll put it in. Walk to the patient's room, knock on the door, identify the patient and myself. I would explain the procedure to them and verify their allergies. All right, so now I'll perform hand hygiene and on the floor. Lord, I'll take my alcohol pen. for 30 seconds. Attached to And my tubing is attached. And then I would administer the drops. I've administered the medication. I would then hang my solution back to its primary setting, turn, close the clamp, and discontinue the administration. And I would dispose of my equipment appropriately and wash my hands. After washing my hands, I would then document the time that it was administered and initial and sign where it.